Alright, welcome to Tomb Raider, Angel of Darkness, the DVD edition! <laughs> this uh, is gonna be pretty hardcore. Yeah. I'm Sai, and this is... Pinky Starry. Pinky Starry. <sighs> now, in lieu of the new Tomb Raider game, we decided to have a go at this! It just looks so thrilling. Yeah. Glad you could join me. You're going to need to know a few things before we get started. In this adventure, cool. you use your DVD remote <laughs> to control the action. Press the arrow buttons up, down, left, and right, and the enter or OK button that sits in the center to make choices during the game. Okay, so the completely simplified. Screen, showing your options. So in this instance, <laughs> press left to grab mm. the cable. I know what! To make the game even easier! Let's make it a DVD! You don't have to press anything except left, right, up and down! And on occasion, enter! To be honest, it is a big improvement from the original Angel of Darkness, I think! <laughs> yes. I, I couldn't get past the first level. And, mind you, I'm, I tried playing this not long ago, like a few months ago. And I just couldn't. It was the controls. Yeah, they are pretty bad. They are awful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I got pretty far in the game, um, up to the last boss fight, I think, and it just glitched terribly that I had to start again, and I thought, my god, I'm not going through this again, just for the sake of a, you know, 30, 40 second ending scene, you know, just get on YouTube and see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> well, in this instance, we have the whole game summarised, and we barely have to play it. So, for everyone who finds Tomb Raider too hard, play this! It's really, really simple! <laughs> It's the easy man's oh. version. And yes, you, you can have two player. Team one and team two. And basically you take it in turns and see how many points you get. And whoever gets the most points, I guess, Win. wins a biscuit. <laughs> yeah. maybe. Do you have biscuits in your cupboard? I don't know. <laughs> well, I'm, okay. I'm maybe. So should we do this as a one team or a two? Look. Oh... Uh, let's do it one team. We'll do one team. One to one team, yeah. because... Welcome to this action adventure starring our heroine, Lara Croft. Since she left behind her aristocratic Arastri <laughs> inheritance... <laughs> <laughs> in search of adventure, Lara has faced many perilous situations and dangerous foes, but this m might prove to be the most telling, testing yet. Telling? An old friend called. Oh, so you're saying it for me. An old friend and colleague asked Lara for help. Oh god, it's always doing it for me. <laughs> what am I reading? It? See? I mean, it even tells you the dialogue. You don't even have to read it. You can shut your eyes. And nope. What's going on? angry with Oh my god, look at those graphics. <laughs> so realistic, I feel so toasty. It's like one of those um, old PC moving screen yes. um, wallpapers, Absolutely. dynamic wallpaper. <laughs> yes. I remember having one of those on my PC, right about the time when Tomb Raider 2 came out actually, and uh, had this flame background. I thought, my God, this is so realistic. <laughs> oh God, look. Oh my God. Look how badly that's rendered. They literally copied that from the game. Yeah. Yeah, they, I really don't think they could be bothered with this game. They just kind of threw it in there and combination of press these buttons through the game. Why should I care? People are dying out there. Handling one I'm going to find it fascinating that she needs to wear sunglasses indoors at night time. Yeah. You know? I wear my sunglasses at night. <laughs> no. Oh no! I'll just throw my pistol over here. <laughs> See, this bit I find quite interesting actually. They kind of went, you know, went to all this effort <clears throat> with the hands and the blood. But where is the blood on his body? No. Yeah. You know? <laughs> that, 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 yeah, that's true actually. <laughs> oh no! Magic blood. <laughs> oh no, I have evidence on my hand. And yeah. the blood is coming towards me. She wasn't particularly smart in this game. No, she was freaking stupid. Yeah, they really dumbed her down in this big time. And they make it really, really sarky and bitchy. Yeah. 
It's like, oh, I know. We'll give Lara doesn't have much of a personality in our four in our five first games on the PS1. So I know. Let's make her bitchy and sarky and cold because that's what we want. We want our protagonist to be dark, dark and edgy. Why does everything have to be dark and edgy for the oh. new eras? Dark and edgy. Maybe it's the way that today's teenagers like things. <laughs> yes. And woe is me. Blood rolled. Woe is so old. I like this background. So don't hang around. Get everyone around. Pop the DVD into your DVD player and prepare for action. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Because I can't wait to throw a house party and break out the Tomb Raider game. <laughs> Bring out the wine, the beer, and the alcohol. Yeah. I know what makes this more fun, guys. Tomb Raider DVD game. <laughs> yeah, I can just imagine everybody leaving at that point. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Here we go. I must get away from the police and find Dude. out what happened. Dude. Recovery Dude. Dude. Notebook Dude. Be yes. Start. Dude. <laughs> Very 24. <laughs> I think we should refer to Laura as Kiefer in this, you know. Kiefer. Well, Although, what was his name in 24? Was it Jack? Yeah, I think it's Jack, actually. Yeah. I can't remember. I, I, um, I, I actually didn't... I haven't actually watched 24 as a series. I just know... <laughs> from that particular thing. So, okay, so... I mean, oh, as oh, you can oh, see... We have gameplay. We have gameplay. So, what should we do? <laughs> hmm. Let's have a search, first of all. So it's good to check your surroundings. Oh! Oh, and by the way, the, the DVD is actually playing all this for me. We literally just select the buttons when the options come up. Yeah. So all this that you're seeing now is already being done for us. Mm. We, we literally don't have to do anything. I mean, she even went ahead and opened the door. The option didn't come back up for me to do that. So, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, if you're going to complain about how difficult Tomb Raider is and you really, really, you know, you just... Play this game. Yeah. <laughs> I think you'll appreciate how yeah. difficult the Tomb Raiders are and how much more fun it is, to be honest. Yeah. Okay. Now, what and should we do? The wise thing to do would be a stealth attack, I think. <laughs> should we see what happens if you shoot? But we're going to see what happens if you shoot. We're going to see what happens if you shoot. shoot. I mean, does she even have a gun? I don't know. She doesn't She oh, doesn't have any... She picked one up. Oh, right, yeah. Hell, let's try it. But where is she, where is she keeping it? <clears throat> She obviously keeps it in the back. I'm of going the to. I'm going to kill this 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 policeman, even though I'm wanted for murder. Yeah. Because this possibly can't make it any worse. Oh no! What should we do now? I mean, we can either look at the gate or use the key. <laughs> Let's look at the gate. <laughs> Why don't we look at the gate? It looks like the only way is down. Okay. Okay. So unlike previous options, it, the menu has now come back up for us to select the other option that was left over. Yeah. Oh, dramatic. So dramatic. Okay, so I think we had about, what did we get? 10, 15 seconds of gameplay there. If, yeah. I mean, if you can call it gameplay. And now we're on to another cutscene. Bing. Right. Oh no, they're bashing through the door. Okay, now... <clears throat> People oh. will find what we'll do is we'll move the cupboard. <laughs> but you'll find that quite a lot in this game the uh, the play safe option comes up. Yes. Uh, now that is really if you don't want I mean you don't have to use your brain in this game anyway. No. Um but you know, if you want to explore it a little bit more, then you know, I've obviously opt out of again. choosing the play safe. If you choose play safe, I mean it plays through the whole chapter for you near enough, yeah. doesn't you, you it? Don't, you, to even to ca I'm gonna use the word casualize to casualize it even more. Yeah. Just press play safe and she'll do everything for you. Yeah. I mean, you don't even have to do this to... bit. You don't... No. No. No, if we had chosen play safe she just previously, does, yeah. she would have completely done all this part for us. Um, okay. Oh no, QTE. This is technically... This is Angel of Darkness, the QTE game. Because it technically is completely... Yeah. Quick time event without the gameplay. I can't believe they actually. I can't believe they actually made this. Yeah, it's. Uh, it's Twelve plus. Dire. Okay. I love how they they suddenly have this like um, close up of her. 
Yeah. To Japan, I was like, what are you gonna do? Yeah, we're not doing that, by the way. The game, the game is choosing the levels yeah, for us. Yeah, it's choosing the uh, the floor that we need to go to. I mean, you know, just to point out, we were actually on this floor earlier. Um, you know, as you can tell from the running jump, and we never had the option to explore that room there. So we had to go all the way up the stairs to bring the elevator up to take us back <laughs> to where we were. To uh, oh, to no! grab a point. Congratulations! <laughs> we have plus one points. So you know. After and she's exiting that. for us. Did we, did we have to do? Did did we even have to do anything out there? Four points out of five. What did we do wrong? So we missed a point somewhere. Yes, yeah, so we missed a point somewhere. Oh no. Okay, so we've got four out of a hundred. And we have a passcode. Oh yeah, this is another thing. If you're playing the game and uh, you get highly bored of it. <laughs> and for some reason you want to come back and carry on where you left off that's what your passcode's for kind of like um no that's game yeah the Nintendo crash, game. crash bandicoot was another mm. one wasn't it that you could oh, um yeah older well, cartridge games had that as well and um the police is still on my ps1 trail, era too yeah, yeah. 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 Apartment this way. okay now this was uh is this a bit that was in the opening of the dvd yes this was yeah now <laughs> th here's the, th the thing Okay, should we show the guys play safe? Mm, yeah, right. Yeah? No, 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 do this bit, do this bit, do the... Um, okay, so, on. obviously we've already seen that we need to uh, grab, grab the, the cable. cable. Now here's the dumb bit. Because I actually introduced this to my friend Tim, or Rail, and uh, he tried playing this, by the way. Yeah. He chose jump. Yeah. And she's trying... Now, by the way, it's about that she's trying to hide from the helicopter. It mustn't let me see. Yeah. It can see you! <laughs> it just saw you! But because you pulled up... Because it went you straight past you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we'll... Um, we'll hide? Yeah. We'll yeah. And now the helicopter can't see you, even though you're not standing behind the crate. Okay, so in this instance... Do you want to do... Should we see what happens if you go left? We'll go left. Let's see what happens. This doesn't look like it's gonna end good. Oh no! Okay, so she she decided to run out and <laughs> stand in the spotlight like a pillock, <laughs> waiting to be shot. So I think we'll go for eliminating it. left and you know skipping over play safe. We'll go for it. Well, no okay. sequence up, up, down, up. I actually did this once, um, and I didn't actually press it in order. I just pressed down and went left, then up, and it actually let me do it. Really? Yeah. There oh was no, God. there is no consequence as long as you actually press those <coughs> particular buttons within the time limit. It's fine. Okay, I think we'll jump. Yeah. Yeah. It's the right choice. Oh, and. Uh... You know, if people can obviously hear the the background noise, you'll notice that there's music from near enough every Tomb Raider before Angel of Darkness was yeah. released is in this game. <clears throat> the sad thing is, this is Tomb Raider Six. I know yeah. this is actually Tomb Raider Six. This is the sixth game made by Core Design because the original Tomb Raiders were made by Core, and then after this game, it was given to Crystal Dynamics. Yes, yes, that is true. <clears throat> mm. Okay, now obviously the helicopter's above us, so, so I guess we could go down. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. Let's climb down. This is probably going to be the wrong option, or not. Oh, we got a point. Excellent. Hey. <laughs> we'll play this for you. Don't worry. We'll get past the crazy platforming. And figuring out the exit for you. What a thrill. Sorry, <laughs> the <A> ladder. <laughs> Actually, in Tomb Raider 2, I swear, I'm gonna find this, but I swear there is a ladder climbing section in Tomb Raider 2 that felt longer than um, MGS3's ladder sequence. I swear. Really? Yeah. <clears throat> I wish I recorded it too. Um, is it near the end somewhere? No, it's like halfway through. It's somewhere like um, a quarter of the way. Oh, right. And there's this really long. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh no! <coughs> Dead. <laughs> or at least in real life, she. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Nope, I'm fine, even though I cracked my head a little. I'm absolutely dandy. <laughs> However, there could have been quite a few old mattresses, maybe or pillows. Or like um, cardboard boxes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so again, four points out of five, so we missed a point We missed somewhere. something. I don't know how that <laughs> We missed something. We seem to be yeah. making the right choices. Okay. You have scored eight points out of a hundred. Feel good. Feel good. Yeah, you, oh, yeah. you got eight points. <laughs> And, uh, you know, if anyone actually rushes out to buy this, <laughs> you can use our passcode to uh, carry on from this point. I don't know if you can find... I found this in a bargain bin. I kid you not. That really doesn't surprise <laughs> me, you know. No, but it was like, um... Oh, it was like a really old video shop. I don't know if it was our old video shop. They used, um... The, sort of the Apollo? Apollo, yes. Yeah. I think I, I either found it there, or I found it in Blockbuster. I can't remember. I have yeah. just come from Werner. But is that old? Yeah. How is Werner? I'm afraid Werner is dead. What happened? Dun, dun, dun. It's all a bit vague. I arrived at his apartment today from London. He was babbling with fear. Werner left a package here with me. I was to give it to you if anything happened to him. Do you know what it is? Miss Carter. notebook. Who was the commission from? The client's name was Eckhart. He and she's wearing gloves indoors. Yeah. She, she, she's old. Glasses she's on. old. Maybe she's cold. <laughs> she's got like half Tomb Raider glass from the original <laughs> yes, game. Yes, yes. It's safe for the moment. Decision time! You actually get to choose your dialogue! Did, okay. Did that actually happen in the original Angel of Darkness? Yes, you could actually pick um, which route to go down. Although I think a lot of the time in Angel of Darkness, regardless of what you picked, um, you know, you would still kind of get the outcome that you needed, but I think with this one, if you go for the more sort of bitchy yeah. attitude, then it will be game over. So, you know, although they've really given Laura this hardened point. image, yeah. you have to actually pick the nice the stuff to say to people, you yeah. know? Actually, um, Rail, he, he, in a little later, you'll meet this woman. Yeah. And he picked the bitchy option. And he still got through fine. Really? Yeah. What, in this game? Yeah, yeah, in this game. Wow. Because I, I wanted to see his reaction because he was um, wow. showing me dead aim. Was this to... Janice, maybe? Yes. Yes. Janice. <laughs> choose, seriously, choose a bitchy option. Ooh, four five out of points. Five. Okay. Wow. So, I we mean... are good gamers. <laughs> <laughs> we are so excellent. I mean, you know, we will just be on the game testing panel from now on, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I only counted two points though through that yeah. scene. So how did we get five? I don't know. Okay.